What's up YouTube, Sploosh here, and I'm going to start a mini little series here. Uh, I'm probably going to name it something like uh, Nukin' Like a Newbie in, for Modern Warfare 2. Basically the premise is this, uh, Modern Warfare 2 was my first first person shooter on console, and I was terrible at it, but uh, you know I have a uh, head on my shoulders and I kind of figured out things. Um, when when I played Modern Warfare 2, my obsession was nukes. To me, nothing was more fun than nuking. Everything else just didn't seem as fun or cool or whatever. I don't know how you want to say it, but for me, it was like a rush. When I, I you know, I've talked about this in another video, but for me, I love getting multi kills. I I don't know. I love pushing the limits. However you want to say it, but for me, nuke was obsession. Uh, it, it's kind of an I win button. How about that? For me, uh, I love the idea of the I win button. It didn't matter if you're winning or losing. You could be down a million points. It, all hope could be lost. Then, whoa, you just got a nuke and won the game for your team. How cool is that? So, moving on. Uh, you're going to see me play like a newbie and, in Modern Warfare 2. If you don't like watching someone noob tube, if you don't like people playing like newbies, uh, then maybe this isn't the series for you. Just avoid it. When you see me upload these videos, just ignore them. I gotta say though, it's been a lot easier for me lately. I mean, I haven't played Modern Warfare in a long time. When I come back to it, it's, it just feels like such an easy game now. And I, I'm sure it has a lot to do with maybe me getting better, but it might be because people playing now are not very good. But, uh, you know, uh, me using the noob tube, I'm gonna do this. I've already got like four or so videos, and I've nuked a lot already just for fun. And, uh, wow, I should have died there. That would have been it. it I, one thing you'll find about nuking, there's always going to be like this one moment in the game where if somebody didn't drop the ball on the opposing team, you would have not got your nuke. It's kind of interesting when you think about it. It's kind of, I don't know how to say this, it's kind of like when the other team gets nuked, they deserved it. You know, even though I'm playing like a noob and I'm doing a lot of cheap tricks. Uh, because the there's this in my opinion there's at least one way to nuke like a noob on every single map I'm probably gonna end up doing maybe even like two videos one for each side of the map uh, you know I played this game a lot and so I have all kinds of weird strategies you know I play with my friends and I tell them oh yeah I'm gonna try to nuke on this map and they're always kinda uh, they're probably always hearing me saying something like yeah I got some trick on this map or something like that well now when you watch these videos you'll see exactly what I'm talking about it's kinda cool when you're recording yourself isn't it but um you know I don't normally nuke on this side of the map I kinda prefer the other side but uh, I just sort of make do with what I have there was many times in this game where I could have died uh, and I actually had to really earn this nuke because you know normally you get the harrier and you get the chopper gunner and bam you got a nuke but in this game I think my chopper gunner gets like three kills or something so this is kind of a long longish game it's I chose this game because I wanted to introduce it you're gonna find all the videos after this video are extremely short they're probably gonna end up being like four or five minutes maybe even less I don't know I have to look but um you know because there's sort of a trick on every side of the map it kind of is going to require me to make probably a video maybe two videos one for each side of the map um, and I'll probably upload them like maybe like once a week or something just to keep things mixed up and not bore everybody but um you know uh, let me think here what am I gonna say yeah this is where the chopper gunner fails this is really a bad chopper gunner map I'm not a big fan of the AC-130 though I don't know I I think the AC-130 can be better than the chopper gunner, but I just like the point and click of the chopper gunner. I feel like there's a whole finesse behind the AC-130, and keep in mind the concept here. This is uh, nuking like a noob, and uh, you know maybe the AC-130 is just a little, it or was or is a little complicated for me, and I just have no interest right now in really learning it. I think the AC-130 is coming back in Modern Warfare 3, so you know maybe I'll put some time into trying to figure that thing out, but. I've only used the AC-130 to unlock all the kill streaks. It was sort of a game for me for a while where I wanted to get all the kill streak icons, and I did, of course, get them. Holy shit! Uh, but uh, here, uh, you know, I'm kind of turtling back. I I think the enemy team at this point can see my score and probably is thinking like, "Oh my god, that Splush guy's probably gonna nuke us. Let's go get him." Because 
they they start to show up here. They might they might be giving up on B too, which I don't blame them. You know, <laughs> look at me bouncing grenades. I just wanted to see, I guess, if I could do it or not. Um, obviously, feeding off B is the objective of this map. It always is. Even if you're on the other side, you're kind of feeding off B and hoping for some cheap kills. Maybe when a guy comes around. You see here, there's an AC-130 in the air. Uh, if I was on the other side of the map, I'd be freaking out right now because it's not so easy to hide from an AC-130. Um, this movie's er, this movie. This uh, video is winding down, though. I'm kind of drawing a blank as to what else to say. Let me go with some silence here and think for a minute. All right, I'm back. So, you know, this only really works on groundward domination. I know I've gotten nukes. Uh, I've got them in Team Deathmatch too, I guess I should say that too. Uh, it's a little harder, and you gotta really have a flow and, and a lot, but I, I've done it. It's, it's doable, and I, it, I may even show some of those too, you know. But generally, you gotta have ground war, because you need a lot of food, and you need a lot of people who aren't that good at the game. I saw there my teammate died, and I just predicted that that dude's probably gonna come around the corner to get me next. He, pr he definitely knew where I was, since I'm spamming, and my dots probably appearing all over the map. Um, you know... As you can see, I'm using Army of One. Most of these videos will be Army of One, but there are some maps where I never Army of One. Instead, I use the UMP Silence with uh, Ghost or Cold Blooded, you can call it. I was hoping for some freebies right there. Not going to happen. Uh, you know, there are some maps where if you tactically insert on the other side of the, t the map and you play a lot of, like, hit and run, uh, you will get nukes very easily you'll shoot everybody in the back and they never it's it's amazing how oblivious people are you shoot them in the back and then you go and hide in some bushes and they just sort of I don't know forget you're there or assume you're dead or something like that um, so you know uh, y you'll notice my um, tag is like Mach 5 and I did earn that legit like basically what I would do is play on a map which name I can't even remember it's the one with the three bridges and I would just sneak around and use the UMP and I'd silence and I'd just get right behind someone and go dun dun dun, you know. And then I'd hide and then I'd wait for a sniper to go back in his perch and dun dun dun, you know. Uh, you're going to find I'm going to use the nuke right away because I, well, what the hell am I doing? I don't know. I should be using the nuke right away because I want this game to end and make this fast. I do want these videos to be quicker in the future. So, yeah, okay, nuke's ticking down. That's the end of this. Uh... Stay tuned if you're interested. I think this will be fun. I mean, come on. It's it's fun to watch nukes. It's kind of cool. You could try these strategies if you have never tried them before. Uh, you'll find some maps are very creative. And, you know, in some maps, I think there's even three ways to nuke. So, you know, a lot of fun on that. But thank you for watching. Uh, love all you, my viewers. And stay tuned for more.